Um, so I just want to tell you guys a little, you know, brief story I had with one of my consumers. His name is Steven. Uh, Steven came into my office asking to, um, for assistance in finding work. And I realized it's never easy to ask somebody for help. So I strive to make everyone who seeks my help feel comfortable as possible. It didn't take too long while talking to Steven and relating to him on many issues in life in general that he opened up to me and told me a little bit about his personal life as well as his disability. Um, Steven is retired and currently on social security. He told me how his monthly check isn't that most, isn't the most. And at the end of the month, after all bills are paid, he has very little to live on. Um, he told me that he would like to work part-time so that it wouldn't affect his social security. And uh, he told me when the pandemic happened, he had the urge to get back to work due to him just kind of getting cabin fever. Steven informed me that he had worked in the construction carpentry field for nearly 40 years. After hearing about his past, I, was, I thought I could help him apply to a position at our local flea farm, which is comparable like a Home Depot. Um, I heard from a colleague a few days prior that they were holding a job fair and they were essentially, and that they were essentially gonna hire you on the spot as long as you just filled an application out. Given Steven's age and his line of work he did for over 40 years, I didn't want him to have to do anything strenuous and anything that required physical labor. Steve will be the first to tell you he isn't the most tech savvy. So with that being said, I offered to help him do an online application so that there wouldn't be any problems with him having to upload and submit. Um, Steven and I thought that a sales position in the tools and building supplies would be his best fit due to his extensive knowledge and his career of line of work. Unfortunately, there were no current available positions for the said job he was hoping to get. Steven and I had went through the hiring process, which was quick and easy with his boss, and he thought that he would give it a try. After the first day of work, Steven had called me stating that although he liked the job a lot, he didn't think it would be a good fit due to his dyslexia and having to use those hand remotes to scan the inventory in as well as using walkie talkies. Um, I feel that being so welcoming with Steven, it, it was very easy for him to just just had quit the job you know if he wanted to but instead he called me and said sean is there anything that you can do to help me so i called the supervisor and explained the situation you know steven's disability and she was more than willing to accommodate and move him somewhere else so it's nice to be able to inform you that steven is still currently working part-time he loves his job they moved him in a different department to where he doesn't have to use the handheld devices and scan everything in and i know he was thankful that he was able to you know come to me and i was able to help and assist him too and I just thought that was a great story to share with everybody 